Hey, what's going on guys? The Hover Man back with the next Top 20 for 2020. This time I'll be counting down my top 20 favorite 80s horror films. The Top 20 for 2020 series was created by myself and Jason from Horrific Nightmares, but you guys already know that by now. Twice a month we randomly select a theme and rank our top 20 favorite films that pertain to that theme. In these lists, we can only feature 20 films, no honorable mentions. We can only include one film per franchise, and Jason and I will only feature films we actually own on physical media. The randomly selected theme this time around was 80s horror films, not to be confused with 80s slasher films, which we already ranked. Now, with that being said, this list will include some 80s slasher films, because it's my top 20 horror films of the 80s, and obviously some of those will be slashers. As with all my other lists, please keep in mind this is just my personal opinion. I will start at number 20 and work my way down to number 1, my favorite 80s horror film. Also, since this is the 80s we're talking about, I will be doing what I did for my 80s slasher film ranking only showing VHS tapes, because, well, it's the 80s. However, that had no effect on my ranking whatsoever, because I own all of these films on multiple formats. And so, here we go. My Top 20 for 2020 of my Top 20 Favorite 80s Horror Films. Coming in at number 20 is Puppet Master. Ironically, Puppet Master 2 was number 20 in my previous Top 20 for 2020 video when we ranked our top 20 favorite horror sequels. At number 19 is an annual Halloween season watch, Night of the Demons. Coming in at number 18 is just a really fun movie I enjoy revisiting quite often, House. Coming in at number 17 is a movie I consider to be one of John Carpenter's best, The Fog. At number 16 is one of my all-time favorite horror remakes, it's The Blob. Look at that cover. My number 15 pick is another movie that was featured in my last Top 24 2020, because it's one of my favorite horror sequels of all time. It's Creepshow 2. We are up to a few camp slashers now, starting with number 14. This is Body Count. At number 13 is Sleepaway Camp, and this is my VHS copy signed by Felissa Rose. Coming in at number 12 is considered by many to be one of the best camp slashers. It's The Burning with a very young George Costanza. At number 11 is Terror in the Isles. Now, I wasn't sure if I was going to include this one or not, because it's not technically a horror film, but at the same time, it sort of is. It's a horror documentary, and it was always found in the horror section at the video store. Regardless, it's my ranking, and I felt like it belonged, because this was a huge part of 80s horror for me and I absolutely love this film. We are into the top 10 now with a movie that needs no introduction. It's The Terminator. At number 9 is one of my favorite vampire films of all time, The Lost Boys. Coming in at number 8 is a movie with a sequel that made it very high on my top 20 favorite horror sequels ranking. Hellbound Hellraiser 2 was high on that list, and Hellraiser is number 8 on this one. My number 7 pick is the movie I ranked number 1 on my top 20 favorite zombie films list. It's The Midnight Hour. Coming in at number 6 is a horror film I consider to be one of the most underrated horror films of all time. But that's probably because it's so obscure and so rare. It's Junior from 1985. We've made it to the top 5 now with Halloween 4, The Return of Michael Myers my favorite of all the Halloween sequels. And coming in at number 4 is another movie that topped another one of my top 20 lists, Friday the 13th Part 2, which I consider to be my number one favorite 80s slasher film. But this list is 80s horror films in general, so on here it's number 4. Coming in at number 3 is Phantasm 2, which took second place in my top 20 favorite horror sequels list but on this list, it takes third. Second place here goes to Dolls. I absolutely love this movie. It is so much fun. And the really short runtime definitely matters in this case because the movie flies by. 
I remember when I was younger renting this one and watching it back to back, just because I loved it so much. And that feeling never went away. I can revisit this one all the time and never get tired of it. It's number two in my top 20 favorite 80s horror films. Well guys, if you know me, then this is no surprise, because my number one favorite 80s horror film is also my favorite horror film of all time. It's The Evil Dead. I've said it before, I'll say it again, and I'll say it forever. To me, The Evil Dead is the ultimate horror film. A bunch of people go into a cabin in the woods, do something stupid, and pay the price. It's creepy, it's atmospheric, it has amazing practical effects, and it introduced the world to the iconic Ash Williams. The Evil Dead also went on to spawn two fantastic sequels, and a pretty decent remake. But the original will always be a classic. And it's my number one favorite 80s horror film. So there you have it guys, my top 24 2020 of my top 20 favorite 80s horror films. What do you think? Comment below and let me know. And be sure to check out Jason's Top 20 as well. Also, as always, we invite you to join in. We'd love to see your Top 20 for 2020. Thanks for watching, guys. Be kind. Subscribe.